Now I'm feeling I could do with a bit of a nightcap, some more delicious food, and I've heard there is a new bar in town which has more than a few uses for tequila. Very much me. Bring it on. Cheers, welcome Cheers. to our town. Yeah. Enjoy responsibly. It's not, what you, host. it's not what you're drinking, it's who you're drinking with. Yeah. And La Rumbla, the name itself, obviously it, it conjures up some images, but where does it come from literally? Well, the Rambler in Barcelona were all the parties and bars and good times, late night dining, food. We designed this company around creating a place where people like us would want to hang out. We've travelled a lot, met a lot of great people. It was actually the original name for La Rumbla. But we wanted people like us to grow as a company and La Rumbler to be a great product of it. Speaking of... Yum. What have we got here? This, this, is, this is dangerous. Uh, these are two cocktails off our list at uh, La Rumbler. This lovely pink drink is our chilli and raspberry daiquiri. So it's got a good dollop of stolen white rum in there and the chilli is something that carries on through our menu. We believe there is a bit more to pepper and salt as far as seasoning goes. Let's use paprika, let's use cumin, let's use chilli, and uh, let's put it in our drinks. Cheers. Cheers. It's good. Yeah? <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. Cool. I love um, drinks and food that give you more of a sensation than just your taste. Yes. They give you a bit of, bit of bite. They, they get yeah. your body sort of waking up or usually waking up, yeah. Well, our cocktail list is also designed to go with our food. Right. So we believe in, in <clears throat> eating and drinking. Everything should go hand in hand. All right. Awesome. So, okay, what do we got here? This is uh, the confit pork belly. Uh, it's got a little bit of pickled red cabbage on top and it's served with a quince aioli on the side. Um, the blue cod ceviche with a coconut and chili salad and some freshly baked garlic, pumpkin seed and rosemary bread. In the third edition, uh, this is one of my personal favourites, is the uh, coconut fried chicken. So we've got chicken thigh that's been uh, lightly poached in, in coconut, and then uh, served with a chipotle aioli, uh, tequila salsa. Uh, we do enjoy tequila here at La Rumbler, mm -hmm. and I've even found a use for it in the food. I can and, always find a use for tequila, I have to say. Yeah, we keep a bottle in the kitchen, and uh, you know sometimes it even makes it into the food. <laughs> Tell you what, this is really, really good. I really like Thank this combination. You, yeah. yeah. You're getting a bit of the tequila coming through? Absolutely. Yeah, and I'm, nice. I'm a massive tequila fan, and, and I hate the salt and lemon bollocks. Well, that's just a sky's bad quality tequila. Exactly, yeah. I, I think a good tequila, you can, you can drink it just neat. Of course. Shall we have one? Mate. <laughs> I probably had it already had more than I probably should. Nah, that's cool, bro. <laughs> Here we go then. Skull. Skull. <sighs> Delicious. <laughs> Proudly brought to you by Small Town Media.